How's it going guys? This is Coach Tactical here with Corbin and we made some World War One, post World War One, you know, 1920s themed bikes. It took a long time, but we finally got there and as you can see, they look really nice. Now we kitted them up like we're gonna kit them up during the expedition so we can travel where the Jeep couldn't and we can travel a lot further and we can carry a lot of gear as you can see. Back here we have our stove, food, water, stuff like that. Here, personal items, flashlights, water, canteen up here is a sleeping roll we got a wool blanket wrapped up just one for now we got a leather strap so we can you know tie things up as you can see we got all this tied up all around and we're just gonna have to see how these last and it is a really nice crisp sunset going on it's kind of windy and chilly because the cold front's moving in but yeah we're gonna pedal regardless i am gonna get new pedals by the way so um they haven't came in yet but we're just gonna have to rock with those but yeah, it's looking good. We also got hatchet on the side right there. I got a spade, World War One spade right there. By the way, we're also gonna change these to wood boxes. We just only have cardboard right now. So we're about to go out, go on the road and just, you know, experiment with them. Shout out to the Patreon supporters and Ron Cordish for making this possible. You guys that support me really help us do these kinds of builds. And thank you, Ron Cordish, because he sent $100 when we're making these bikes. So it really helped finish up the project and allows us to get them, you know, looking like this. Cause this wasn't cheap to do. Like this, this cost quite a bit. I didn't want to say it yet, but they're quality bikes. That's what stuff was like back then. You know, I'm going to get the best quality I can get. Extra money worth it sometimes, but yeah, we're pretty much going to go. We got like standard kit on, nothing special. So you got the gloves, so wool sweater, putties, Converse, this little cap. I got the Converse putties, this roll neck sweater, 1905 and some gauntlets. I think we're ready to go ahead, get these bikes and ride them off into the sunset. Let's go. I have a little mount for the GoPro, so it's going to stick right there. But we're gonna have to roll it out of this pasture because it's really thick. Man, it looks nice, so. Good thing about bikes is they're fairly light. <laughs> so when we're in the mountains of New Mexico, we can just push them. Mechanical pony. You know what I, I named my bike? Its name is Oatless. <laughs> Oatless, get it? Because it doesn't need oats to move, like a horse. Oh yeah, by the way, I got a lot of ropes here. Yeah, what's that purpose? Go ahead. You ever need to make an adjustment? Let's go. that sunset was here that'd be perfect yeah beautiful sunset always check each other's bikes making sure they're all good hello pop good day good day pop Cowboys, dude, we're hurting. Uh oh. <laughs> 
Beautiful. 